Yo, what's up everybody? It's Vic back with another video. Today's video is going to be the RuneScape 2014 Christmas event. To start this event, you're going to want to go to Draenor. You don't really need anything, but I suggest you bring Valley Teleport, Avrog Teleport, and Draenor Teleport methods. And also some rum pots if you'd like. I'd keep an empty inventory so you have space for this. So, first thing you want to do is speak to Diango. You'll talk to Diango right here. You can be found in the market. You want to tell him that you can help him with his problem. He'll talk to you about how the fairies in his workshop are hopeless and he needs your help. You can go ahead and skip through all of this. Once you get to here, hit, do you want me to not drop the crates at the gate? Drop the crate at the gate then. Go ahead and skip through this right here. And now that we've offered to help him and understand what his problem is, say no thanks. Now we're going to run over here to the north. Just north of the market, you'll come over to two exclamation points on your mini-map. You want to go to the one that's inside the house. You'll notice that there's a trap door inside the house. Go ahead and drop down the trap door. Any minute now. Currently closing and opening the trap door because I'm retarded. Alright, so once you come down here, you'll notice the pixie rosy. Go ahead and talk to Rosie. She'll give you the breakdown on what you need to do. If you have any questions, she'll tell you all about it. The first things you want to do is go ahead and grab a box for your painted baubles. Go ahead and grab a box for your marionettes also that you will be making. So now we have both the boxes. Now what you're doing down here, go down this ladder right here, is you're going to want to put together a puppet. The puppet has to be put together in a certain way. I suggest grabbing multiple puppets so you can make more at one time. I'm going to grab one of each puppet color. A blue one, a green one, and a red one. And now the first thing you want to do is grab the puppet's torsos. After the torsos, you have to move to the head. As you see, as I click on the box, it puts the puppet together in my inventory. So now after the head, you want to go ahead and move over here to the arms. Alright, as you see the arms are being placed onto the puppets and you want to come over here and do the same thing for the legs on each one of the puppets. Alright, now that you have your puppets, you're going to want to go upstairs. You want to talk to Rosie, she'll notice that you have puppets in your inventory and she'll help you by stringing the puppets. Once your puppets are stringed, you just click the puppet, insert it into the box. Now, to fill the box, you're going to want to have two of each color puppet inside the box. And you're also going to want to obtain eight of these boxes filled up. So once I fill up eight of these boxes, I'll be right back and we'll get to the next step. Alright, you guys, we're finishing up our last box of puppets right here. Boom. So we have a total of 8 boxes ready to go for the angle. So now your puppet portion of this is complete. Now we want to move on to the decorations portion. Now you just want to go over here to the northeast and you'll find a bunch of big present boxes. Right click the present boxes and hit take 10 decorations. Now for this you're going to need also 8 decorations. Go ahead and fill your inventory up. Now you're going to need 8 decoration boxes filled up to the brim for this part. So you just want to run over here to the table with all these plain decorations, click on the table, and you're going to want to get one of each color. Once you have one of each color, you just want to throw it in here. So just click the color, it'll paint it, it'll be a little delay. Do each color, there's five colors in total. Let's go ahead and knock this out. And the last one. Alright, so once you have all your colors, you just go ahead and insert them into the blue box. Bring that box over here to her. She'll take the box and tell you how many boxes you still need. Well, she'll tell you that the reward's ready. Now, this portion of this is for the scarves and the hats and stuff like that, so you can retrieve those from Diango. Now she'll tell you that you need seven more of those boxes, and don't forget about the big tree and Varrock. For the big tree, you'll need five of these decoration boxes. So you'll need eight for her and five for the tree. So I'm going to go finish getting my 
seven boxes for her and then my five boxes for the Christmas tree and then I'll meet up with you guys again alright you guys I'm filling up the last box for her ornaments that she needs for the complete eight boxes of decorations here we are give this to her that's eight boxes completed for the decorations she also reminds me about the tree and also you can see right here I've been collecting uh, the scarves and the hats from Diango as I've been giving her the presents so now we need five more of those decoration boxes for the Christmas tree and then we can deliver these boxes so I'll be right back with five more of these decoration boxes alright you guys we finished packing up the boxes we have five decoration boxes ready to go for the Christmas tree and Varak and we have all eight of our puppet boxes now we're gonna go deliver these I'm gonna head over to Fally and from Fally, you're just going to follow this path right here to the north. Go out the north gates of Fally and follow the path west all the way up till you get to the Taverly Gates where it separates the free world from the member world. And once you get to that gate over there by where you do Dorak's quest, you'll see Santa Claus. So I'm going to quickly run over here and I'll be right back when I see Santa. Alright you guys, a few seconds up the pathway, you'll find Santa Claus right here next to where you do Dorak's quest. You talk to Santa. You hand over the box of the toys, you see that they're gone. They'll say thank you for the eight boxes, ho ho ho, yeah yeah yeah. And you'll see we unlocked the rest of the jester hats and etc. So now we want to go to Varrock. Teleport to Varrock. Once you get here you'll see everything is covered in snow. Use your boxes on the tree. And as you use the boxes on the tree you'll see that it gets more decorated and once you completed that you'll go into a little cutscene and it'll show you how nicely the tree looks so we'll just enjoy this real quick Alright, so once the little cutscene's over, you can go over here, unwrap your gifts, and from this little mini quest, mini event for the holiday, you'll get your all your holiday items, they'll hook you up, and you'll get the new holiday items, which is the Santa outfit. The full Santa outfit with the Santa mask. So thank you guys for watching. I'm Fig. If you guys like my content, like my guides, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, and leave feedback. I love feedback, you guys. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter. For all my updates on whatever I'm working on at it's underscore figment. I T Z underscore F I G M E N T. It's figment. Alright, you guys, thank you for watching. It's figment. I'm out. Peace.